Who will help an old beggar? I will call out my militia if necessary. So be it. Soldiers of Cyrodiil, the Empire will stand or fall by what we do here today. Will we let the David do to Bruma what they did to Kavach? Will we let them burn our homes? Will we let them kill our families? No, we make our stand here today for the whole of Cyrodiil. We must hold fast until the hero of Kavach can destroy their great gate. We must kill whatever comes out of that gate. Soldiers of Cyrodiil, do you stand with me? Stay sharp.
We won a great victory here today, but we need to act quickly. Remember, the portal closes behind you. I'll have the ritual ready in the Great Hall when you arrive. Farewell, my friend. Congratulations on your victory, sir. Good evening. I have everything in place for the ritual. I don't know what you'll find in Cameron's paradise. I do know the portal I create through the Mysterium Xarxes ritual will close behind you. I believe that Manka Cameron acts as the anchor for paradise, just as a sigil stone anchors an oblivion gate in place. Kill Manka Cameron, and you will unmake his paradise. Shall I open the portal to paradise? Farewell, my friend. Brace yourself. So, the cat's paw of the Septims arrives at last. You didn't think you could take me unawares, here of all places, in the paradise that I created. You? No matter. You are too late to stop Lord Dagon's victory, while you will remain here in the Eternal Garden forever. Gaia Alata is the master's name for this place. This is the Savage Garden. Beneath the mountain lies the Forbidden Grotto. We have all died in the master's service. The Forbidden Grotto is the only way out of the Savage Garden. Those who earn the master's favor are given the bands of the chosen. Those favored by the master to wear the bands may enter the Forbidden Grotto. Look Who now upon my paradise. Gaia Alata in the old tongue, a vision of the past. Behold the savage garden where my disciples are tempted for a higher destiny, to rule over Tamriel Reborn. If you are truly the hero of destiny, as I hope, the garden will not hold you for long. Lift your eyes to Kerek Agayala, my seat at the pinnacle of paradise. I shall await you there. How little you understand. 
You cannot stop Lord Dagon. The... Are you here to end this nightmare and... Only those wearing the... Leave me in peace. What news from Tem Many are their names and the names of their masters. The cold harbor of Meridia. Periite's quagmire. The ten moon shadows of Mephala and... And Dawn's beauty. The princedom of Lorcon. Misnamed Tamriel by deluded mortals. Yes, you understand now. Tamriel is just one more Daedric realm of oblivion, long since lost to its prince when he was betrayed by those that served him. Lord Dagon cannot invade Tamriel, his birthright. He comes to liberate the occupied lands. Ask yourself, how is it that mighty gods die, yet the Daedra stand incorruptible? How is it that the Daedra forthrightly proclaim themselves to man, while the gods cower behind statues and the faithless words of... You wear the bands, but you're no prisoner. Can you really do it? Can you bring this eternal nightmare to an end? Can you defeat Mankar Cameron? Listen, I can help you. I was at the sack of Kvach. They had no chance. But they fought on anyway. Desperately. I was slain after the battle was over. They tore me to pieces. Although I have no doubt they were immediately killed by my companions. I've had plenty of time to ponder my deed since I came here. Ponder and regret. For my weakness, the Master sent me here to torture my former comrades who showed similar ingratitude for his gift of eternal life. No one wearing the bands of the Chosen can leave this grotto. I can remove them, but I will need time. Just act like a prisoner and do as I say. Good. Follow me and don't worry. It is simple. They are not gods at all. The truth has been in front of you since you first were born. Let's get into the next grotto. Farewell. Julianos, Dibella, and Stondar are all Lorcan's betrayers. Posing as divinities in the principality that has lost its guiding light. What are scholarship, love, and mercy when compared to fate, night, and destruction? The gods you worship are trifling shadows of first causes. They have tricked you. Why do you think your world has always been contested ground, the arena of powers and immortals? It is Tamria, the realm of change, brother to madness, sister to deceit. Your false gods could not entirely rewrite history. Thus you remember tales of Lorcan Vilify, a dead trickster whose heart came to Tamria. But if a god can die, how does his heart survive? He is Daedroth! Tamrielai Daedroth! This heart is the heart of the world. You made it. I didn't think you'd have any trouble. There. Let me come with you. 
I am no match for Mancar Cameron. Well done, champion. Your progress is swift and sure. Perhaps you will reach me after all. You think I mock you? Not at all. In your coming, I hear the footsteps of fate. You are the last defender of decadent Tamriel. I am the midwife of the mythic dawn, Tamriel Reborn. I welcome you, if you truly are the agent. I tire of the self-styled heroes who set themselves... You did not expect to see me again, did you? You think you can stop us? Soon Mehrun's Dagon will walk upon Tamriel for the first time since the Mythic Age. Come. I have waited a long time for you, champion of old Tamriel. You were the last gasp of a dying age. You breathed the stale air of false hope. How little you understand. You can't... Stop your day -go. You found a way back. Does this mean... You did it. You defeated him. Then you have it. You have the Amulet of Kings. Belongs to me. The Amulet of Kings. So you and Joffrey have said. If it is true, if the Emperor really was my father, then I should be able to wear it. Only those of the Septim Blood can wear the Amulet of Kings. Yes, of course. After all, this is my destiny. I didn't really need the amulet to tell me that. I've known it was true since you first told me back in Kavach. But it is one thing to talk of becoming emperor, and quite another to actually be the emperor. Not yet. 
Until we light the dragon fires, the gates are open and Mayroon's Dagon's invasion continues. While you were gone, I sent a messenger to Chancellor Ricardo. He waits for us in the Imperial City. Chancellor Ricardo is the head of the Elder Council. The Council rules in the Emperor's absence. I don't expect any objections from the Elder Council, but we should defer to their authority. Let's go to the Imperial City at once.